this fella seems to have a pest problem in the Winter's Cradle Tavern Cellar and has asked me to resolve the matter. Okay. Alright, I am not gonna go down there just yet. Since... We are really limited here on weaponry. And there's the door outside. Let's take a look at our spell books real quick and sort that out. Okay, this is Thavik's repertoire here. Definitely gonna get Bless. Um, Shield of Faith is always a good one. Let's get that. Divine Favor. That's also a good one early in the game so let's get that and zero levels let's just get a bunch of cure miners we're probably gonna need them although I can just use them to spontaneously cast too so actually since we can let's get a light spell too and let's see Peldor how we looking here we got acid splash, daze, and flare and then we got enlarged person and burning hands I think we'll be with those, okay with those for now. Is there something you wish? All right. So in the meantime, let's step outside. And here we are in East Haven. All right. This is where we just came from. Pomob's Emporium. That should be the shop. We have the Snowdrift Inn, which is right there. And. Rothgar's place should be down here somewhere. And we have some children. Dilsandra. Chisello. My parents told me not to talk to strangers. Elmadora. Hi there. Okay, it looks like they're messing with a rat there. So let's take a look at our inventory. How much do we have for gold? 100 coins. Since we all are armored up, let's go ahead and go to Pomobs first. See if we can buy a couple weapons. And here we are in Pomobs. And let's take a quick look at who has the highest praise. I am certain. Let's see, Broy's got a two. Yes. You have need of me? And Peldor's got a three, so we might as well take advantage of that. Let's see here. What is this? More barbarians come to my shop? No doubt. With nothing to barter with but more wolf pelts and polished stones. Very well. Let us get this over with. What do you want? Barbarians? I think you're mistaken, friend. I am now. I do not think so. All of you northerners, northerners are the same to me. Smelly and barbaric. Northerners, I take it you're not from around here? I am Pomob, Royal Diplomatic Envoy of Kalamshan and appointed overseer of Northern Caravan Routes. Uh, for forgive me, your lordship, I had no idea. Your poor attempt at sarcasm is an obvious sign of your lowly birth. I'll have you know that I am third cousin to the Pasha himself, not to mention a royal courtier in good standing. My apologies, I did not mean to offend. Yes, well, where I am from, one would normally be beaten for such insolence. Be thankful that I am a merciful man. Now, what can I do for you? Well, let me see what you have for sale. Okay, so he's got a reasonable set or selection of armors, but what we're concerned with at the moment is weaponry. Looks like he's got a decent s selection of weapons. What else does he have? He's got some ale and some wine. He's got some healer's kits, which are quite spendy. Got some traps, a couple torches. Alright, in the meantime... We have 100 gold. We already have a club. So let's see, what kind of weapons can we afford? Morningstar's 33. 
Or I could get a spear. Oh, that's 40, 41. Yes. Broy, what can we what get for Broy? Probably looking at a longsword or a battle axe. Let's see, 62 for a longsword. Battle axe is 41. Hmm. Yes. And what can we get for the thief? We can probably just give him the club, actually. Yes. So that leaves the wizard probably with a missile weapon. Damn, heavy crossbow, 209? Alright, we're not going to afford that crap for now. How much is some darts? Well, I can't use them. Okay, so I think I what certain. we'll do... Walk in my step. Since we oh. really just need two weapons, let's get a... Morning Star for Thavik. And we'll pass the club off to the Thief. Follow me. And let's get a... Do we want a Battle Axe or a Long Sword? I'm thinking Battle Axe, actually. I only have 67 left. Long Sword is 62. Let's just get a Battle Axe. It's only 41 coin. Okay. There's something He's using wish. that as a two-handed weapon, so... This way, and the club, on, let's equip Keep that. You have me. And Peldor, I only have 26 left. And... I guess I could get a quarterstaff for him. His missile weapons are way too spendy right now. I can't afford any of them, so let's get a quarterstaff. That way he's got something to defend himself with, at least. And finally... Yes, let's yes, see, yes. let's get a torch. Let's clear all this out, I'm not going to need any of that. And we only have 20 gold left, and I think that's going to be enough. So, let's get on out of here. Okay, so the next thing we want to do wish. is go to the inn. Then we're going to rest up, get our spells, and then we'll continue on. Okay, we got Quimby. Before we talk to Quimby, let's go look back here. Let's see if there's anything lootable. Maybe we can find a couple things to sell. And we have Aravain Black Sheaf. Before we talk to him, let's look over here again. And we're going to do a quick save. And let's go talk to Aravain. Well met, well met, friend. I am Aravain Blackchief of Evereska. It has been many moons since I have seen friendly faces. Despite the dreary nature of our current locale, Easthaven is a welcome sight for these elven eyes. And tell me, Aravain, have you seen much in your travels? When I set out from Evereska, I was used to a peaceful life. I had no idea what wonders and horrors a life of adventure would bring to my ever-changing doorstep. I'm glad I didn't go on a retreat 20 years ago. Do you know of any other adventurers in East Haven? Yes, I've heard that the locals are forming an expedition into the Kaldahar Pass to investigate some problems there. I won't be going with them, though. I may pass through the area. Have any information to share? Well, I haven't heard any rumors lately. However, when I traveled through Kaldahar, I had a strange feeling about something in that valley. It's more than just the weather that's bothered me. Something seemed to miss in the mountains. The trees, even the clouds in the sky. Something was out of place. Something was wrong. Well, thanks for the advice. Okay. 
so a little bit of tidbit of information there. And let's check our spell books one last time before we rest. And let's see. I think we'll be okay with those spells. Except you wish. You know what I want to really want to do is let's get some more light spells. And let's actually change Let's change that to inflict. And let's talk to Quimby. Greetings, traveler. The name's Quimby, and I welcome you to my inn. You seem rather enthusiastic. Yes, it is rare that I get any travelers at this time of year. Thus, I want all my guests to feel welcome. Have you heard any interesting news lately? Actually, yes, the whole town's been talking about the upcoming expedition into the spine of the world. Tell me more about this expedition. Hrothgar, no doubt, will be leading the expedition. I've heard that Akalia, the initiate at the temple, is going, though I suppose Everard will stay behind to minister the town. There's a dwarf named Hildreth who's going along as well, and even Pomob has agreed to go. What a grand adventure it will be. Okay. Any rooms available? Two gold pieces. Alright, so we rested. And we should have all of our spells. Yep. Yep. Everything's in order. Alrighty. Yes, that is so. so we should be set up now. Let's go back to the tavern and let's deal with the problem in the cellar. Winter's Cradle Tavern. So everybody's got weapons. Everybody should be good to go. Hello, Grishella. We're going to go handle your pest problem in your cellar. All right, we got some fire beetles. And let's use some spells, shall we? Let's go with bless. Although we probably won't really need it, but follow me now. We're gonna use it regardless. No Roy's gonna charge in, and Eric's gonna charge in too. Maybe we can get some. I don't know if we can backstab these beetles, but we'll make the attempt to do so. And Peldor. Uh, fire beetles. Uh, I don't know if burning hands will work on them or not, but let's put a flare on one of them. Okay. Oh, yeah, we can do a sneak attack. Alright, so we want to get rid of these fire beetles that are dealing here. with Peldor here. So let's kill them first. Broy will go up there. Eric will get up here. Oh wow, man. Peldor went down already. Alright, that sucks. So we gotta do some healing. Let's do some spontaneous casting. Alright, let's get that. Eric, do some backstabbing. By the hells! Some do Alright, so Peldor, let's get him out of there. Your deep to Drag him around here, do some damn attacks of opportunity. Yep. Alright, so that's all of them. And anything else down here? No. So what let's head on up. Follow Talk to Grishella and we can close out this one. So we got our first quest here about to be completed. Grishella. Any luck getting rid of those nasty bugs? It's done. Those bugs are going to be troubling you no more. Thank you, dearie. You're a lifesaver. Just do me one more favor. Keep this little bug problem between you and me. Don't want folks thinking Grishella's place isn't clean. Okay, so she gave us five gold pieces and 150 experience points. That's just fine with me. Actually, let's talk to her one more time. Did she have anything else to say? Uh, just passing through. Okay. 
Yeah, Hildreth, he's one of the guys that's going to be going with Hrothgar, see if he's got anything else to say. I was wondering if you heard any news here about Do you think you could help me out? Okay, we got that information already. Thanks for the tip. Alright, so let's mark up, make our way back down to Hrothgar. I think he's down here in one of these buildings. The Fishmonger! Let's go directly to Hrothgar's place. And there he be. And let's do a quick save. And Hrothgar. Well met, friend. And welcome to my home. Make yourselves comfortable. But try not to break anything. Many of these curiosities that you see lying about have sentimental value. Where'd you get all this stuff? Are they all remembrances of my adventuring days? Little trinkets and the like that I picked up here and there? More keepsakes than valuables, really. Leftovers from my days of fortune and glory. Adventuring days? So you were a retired man? Uh, Semi-retired, actually. This region is still untamed and fraught with many dangers. I have had plenty of opportunities in the last few years to take up my sword and shield and do battle with those who threaten the safety of East Haven and its neighbors. In fact, I am planning such an expedition right now. That is what I wanted to speak to you about. What sort of expedition? We've received word from Kaldahar, our neighbors to the south, that evil forces are stirring nearby in the spine of the World Mountains. I am organizing and leading a party from East Haven south to Kaldahar Valley to investigate. You look to be capable enough. Perhaps you'd like to join us. What say you? What sort of evil forces are we talking I about? I don't really know. The messenger wasn't too specific. I suppose if you want more details, you could ask old Everard over at the temple, but time's a wasting. We need to get this expedition moving before the snows seal off the pass to Kaldahar. So what's it going to be? Are you in or out? Sounds exciting, Count Sin. Excellent. Glad to have you on board. I plan to assemble the rest of the expedition and set out for Kaldahar within a few days. With storms brewing in the mountains, I'd rather we depart sooner. But there are matters that require my attention here about town. What sort of matters? Perhaps we could help. Actually, now that I think about it, maybe you can help. Poma, the local shopkeeper, has recently expressed concern over the rapidly thinning stock of his store. He's been complaining that the regular caravan from Care Dineval is long overdue, and that if they don't arrive soon, he's sure to be out of business. Now, normally I take Pomhop's whining with a grain of salt, but with heavy snows on the way, it would be best to make sure that caravan makes it through. So what does it want me to do? I want you to find that caravan. Leave town by way of the South Bridge and scout the hills west of Loch Dinnershire, between East Haven and Care Dineval. Caravans always stick close to the shoreline this time of year. Once you find it, see the caravan safely to East Haven. In the meantime, I'll assemble the rest of the expedition and make the final plans for our journey. Mm -hmm. Return here as quickly as you can. We must make for Kaldahar Pass while the weather is favorable. Good luck. Safe journey. Farewell.